whoever I'm picking up on today, you walked away from somebody and it changed everything. This person, they were really draining you of your life force energy, but they also, it's almost like being around them brought you bad luck, okay? And being with this person or being around this person definitely influenced the path that you were on, okay? Now, I am getting that you recently have walked away from this person. Whether this is a past relationship, a friend, a toxic family member, whoever this person is, they were not good for you. They were not good for your soul. This is somebody who constantly needed attention from you, right? This is somebody that... It's almost like every time that you had an idea, any time that you were on a high vibration or you were feeling good, this person would call you or they would turn up with bad news or it's like they would lower your vibration, okay? And again, it's almost like you feel free walking away from this person now again you may not realize how much of your life force energy this person was taking i am getting that when you moved away from this person they may have got sick okay they may have also become very desperate in trying to get your attention trying to get back into your life, right? This is somebody that when you walked away from them, your path changed, okay? Being around this person was dragging you down. I just seen 212. And again, when you walked away from them, everything changed and you also unlocked some type of spiritual gift okay or you may have just tapped into your spirituality right but I am getting that you feel free I'm getting that you feel almost like a weight has been lifted off your shoulders so for some of you this is somebody that I am getting that this was a relationship or a love interest. Um, they definitely were somebody that they operated from the lower chakra, okay? This is somebody that they have a lot of soul ties, okay? They have a lot of people's energy attached to them. They are somebody that is very reckless with their sexual energy. They are very reckless with who they allow in their energy. Um, they kind of have no boundaries, if I'm being honest. Um, this is somebody that they could even have some type of sex addiction, right? Because I'm getting that this is the type of person that they are easily manipulated when it comes to it's not even manipulated it's just like um they can't say no i just seen 404 you and this person um you no longer were even on the same level or vibration okay and being around this person actually lowered your vibration because they again were very set in the lower chakra, especially um, the sacral chakra. They were very reckless with their sacral energy, which what it was doing, it was actually interfering with your energy, right? It was interfering with your life force. And if this is somebody that, again, you were married to or you had a family, and when I said that, the family card came out, so, you may have had a family with this person or 
again, you could have been married, right? And you may have felt kind of repulsed by this person. And your body may have been rejecting this person, okay? So when you were around this person, you may have looked different, okay? Maybe you kind of looked like them, okay? Or maybe you looked very drained, very tired. Maybe you just didn't feel yourself. Maybe you constantly felt sick around them. I am getting something about your skin, right? So you may have noticed your skin breaking out. And again, your body was literally rejecting this person. Okay? And you... There was a lot going on behind your back here for a while. I, I just seen 606. Um... But there was a lot here going on behind your back and your body may have started rejecting this person and you, it would have manifested in, okay, I thought somebody was knocking at my door, but they weren't. But um, you may have noticed that you started to kind of feel sick, started to feel depleted, um... You may have had unexplained health issues, right? And again, that's because this person was entertaining a whole lot of other people. Um, now, I am getting... You are in the process of moving on from this person, okay? And I am getting that you're actually detoxing this person from your DNA, okay? From your mind, from your body, from your soul, right? And you may be feeling not the best at the moment. I do see you feeling very free without this person. I do see you feeling... Like, again, a weight has been lifted um, and you have also tapped more into your own healing, your own journey, right? Okay, so I am getting that this person had become very desperate to get your attention, very desperate to get in your energy. Um, again, because you seem to be moving on, right? You seem to actually be happy. And this person, they cannot handle it. This is a very bitter person especially at the moment like they are I am getting that they're trying to paint you in a certain light okay they are saying that just I'm just getting that they're spreading rumors here about you they're trying to paint you in a very bad light they are also trying to trap you in some type of way Okay, I am getting that it's like they're trying to make some type of rumor up or they're trying to make you look very bad at the moment. So basically, you're not giving this person any energy. You're not giving them any time. You, there wasn't a time that you were entertaining this person, you were giving this person energy, okay? Obviously, you have a family with them, right? And this one may not resonate for everyone. It is very specific. But whoever I'm picking up on, you're not. It's like this person has become very addicted to 
your energy okay and there was a time that you were feeding them you were feeding them and now you're not now you're moving on now it's like the further away that you get from this person the better that you actually feel this person's not good for your soul they're not good for your mind they're not good for your body right you feel physically sick when they're around okay and this person, I don't know, they just have this very hateful, negative energy to them. And they feed off other people. And you were like a main supply, right? So you will notice that this person, now that you're moving on, that now that you're letting go, they are literally doing everything that they can, everything in their power to... Either even trigger you. Just trying to get a reaction out of you because they want to take your energy. You just reacting to this person, feed them. Right? I just seen 11-11. It's like this person cannot believe... That you are happy without them. And the more happy that you are. And this person they watch you on secret accounts. Okay they have fake accounts. And they're watching you. And they're seeing you happy. And they cannot stand to see you happy right. So this person going to try to create some type of drama. They're going to try to create some type of negative energy in your life to make you kind of they want you on a low vibration but they also want a reaction out of you they cannot handle you moving on you being happy without them the more that you don't react to them the more heartbroken that they are right Yeah, this is somebody that they have nothing better to do than to kind of make your life, to cause drama in your life, right? And they see you happy, moving on, and it's like they're coming in, they're trying to create drama, they're trying to expose you. It's like they're trying to make you look like a really bad person, but it's not working. I am getting that people are just really seeing this person for who they truly are, which is bitter, which is hateful. And again, this person cannot handle that you're moving forward and you're happy without them. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius, Libra energy here. This is somebody that they cannot move forward they cannot move past you and they're very stuck on you and this person's very addicted to your energy this is somebody that they are very misguided okay this is somebody that is very they have a lot of pain inside them and they like to spread hurt pain Again, I do see this person trying to kind of like expose you, make up some type of lie, some type of rumour. They're trying to get a reaction. Don't, I just need 14, 14. Don't give them what they want. Okay? Don't give them what they want because they're looking for some type of reaction. They also want to lower your vibration because they see you happy. They see you happy and thriving without them. Right? And you are somebody that, it's like the further away you get from this person, the more blessed that you get as well. They're not good for you. I just mean 14, 44. I am getting that you are very protected, right? You do have this very healing energy. 
you radiate joy, you radiate comfort. You could be an earth sign, you don't have to be, but you do radiate this like happiness and this comfortable lifestyle. And this person, they can't handle it. They are also very bitter, right? They are also very, like, they are very hateful, very bitter. And again, it reflects in their lifestyle. And the fact that you're so happy, you're thriving, you're being blessed, it triggered this person so much and they just want to bring you down. So I am getting a strong message. Again, they're going to try to trap you into reacting or just giving them some type of energy. Just ignore them. Because again, at one point, you were their main supply of energy. Whether you're dealing with a narcissist or just an energy vampire, um, whatever it is, right? You were their main supply, you were their main source, right? So now they're becoming very desperate. And they want some type of energy out of you. That's why they're trying to trigger you. Do not respond. I just seen 16, 16. So that's all I have for you. If it resonated, let me know. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video.